Good morning. This is Pastor Jason of Kona Faith Center with the word for today. And the word for today is serve. God calls us to serve him. My perception of a servant is someone who waits hand and foot on another. I, I always think of a butler in the English shows I have seen. Oh no, Downton Abbey makes it into the word of the day. Oh, <laughs> And while the butler serves and all the rest of that in Downton Abbey, I think God's calling us to a much higher level of serving him. See, God's not just an employer. He is the unlimited creator. In Philippians, it says to take on the attitude of Jesus. And here's what he says the attitude is. Empty myself, be a slave, humble myself, be obedient. Paul commands us to be of the same mind, have the same love, be united in spirit, have one purpose. Yeah, do nothing out of selfish ambition. Sounds like servanthood to me. Consider others more important than yourselves. Be a servant. Look out for your interests, but look out for the interest of others. Be a servant. And Paul implies this is what Jesus did when he came to earth. So let's be servants. Let's work out our salvation with fear and trembling. Now God is the one who works in us, both to bring his will to pass and to make happen what pleases him. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, be a servant. So be a servant and pay attention to walk in his ways. You know, Lord, we're going to ask that you establish and confirm your word to us. The word says that God repays the wicked, but God rewards the righteous. Just the principle of sowing and reaping here. So let's be servants and reap the reward. God gives to each one according to their ways so that people will fear him and walk in his ways all of their days. So be a servant. Teach us your good way to walk, Lord. Teach us to be good servants. Teach us to not grumble. Teach us to be blameless and innocent in the midst of a crooked and twisted generation. Teach us to be servants and shine the light. Teach us to be servants and hold fast the word of life. Teach us to be servants and rejoice in our serving. Whoa! Be a servant means to be genuinely caring about the flock. It means to seek after Jesus' interests. Be a servant. Be of proven character. Have integrity. God calls us to serve him. We serve him primarily by serving those he brings our way. So let's be a servant today. The word for today is serve. God bless. Check in tomorrow.